So yesterday we watched our video on surface water and we saw that surface water all is our runoff. And we know that runoff always runs downhill because gravity pulls it. Now, it doesn't just run downhill in one direction, it runs downhill in all directions. So let's look at what a watershed looks like and let's look at some of these key vocabulary words. So a watershed is an area or a ridge of land and it separates the waters that flow to a different river. So when we talk about a specific area, like Swift Creek, we can talk about the Swift Creek watershed. That would be all of the water and all of the land that drains into Swift Creek. We can also talk about a bigger system like a river basin. A river basin would contain all of the smaller creeks watersheds all flowing together. So if we talk about the Noose River Basin, and you see signs along the road and along the interstate that mark off where the Noose River Basin is, it's going to be all the land that's going to be drained by that river and its tributaries. So anytime it rains within that area, that rain is going to run off into the Noose River. Now, our different river systems are separated by divides. Divides are, are higher elevated areas that are going to separate the drainage basins. So if we look at a map of North Carolina's river basins, we see the Noose River Basin there in pink, and we see the divide, the border around that river basin. And so we can look at this and see, okay, well, if it lands on one side of the divide, it's going to flow into the Noose River. But if it lands on the other side of that hill, of that high area, it's going to run into the next river basin system. And so we can see here all these different river basin systems are separated by areas of high land. And then all of the water flows down that river basin system from the sides to the middle and then all the way down to the ocean. So when we look at these tributaries, when we look at these streams, we see how they all flow together. So notice here with this watershed, we've got our area of high land. That's our divide here. And we see that on this side of the mountain, water is going to run off into this river basin system. On the other side of this mountain, water is going to run off into the other river basin system. And we see here that our water all runs together. These tributaries all run together to make up our major water system. Now, not only is water flowing across the surface, but water is also able to infiltrate. And so we see our surface water, our runoff, but also underneath this, you've got water that's flowing downhill underground, and that's going to make up our aquifer system.